Professor Jean-Philippe Tiran at Swiss Technology Institute EPFL in Lausanne is testing a new emotion detector that could one day help control road rage and wake up drowsy drivers. Basically we have this camera, this uh, series of LEDs, and then at the back we have a computer analyzing the video in real time. The first difficulty is really the light conditions. And so to cope with that, we, uh, we choose to use an infrared camera, a camera which is sensitive in the infrared, and have infrared lighting, so we get rid of the problem of illumination, uh, and so we can work over day or overnight without problem. The detector is the result of a joint project between EPFL and PSA Peugeot Citroën. Researchers developed an algorithm that taught the detector to identify emotions in photographs and then tested it on live volunteers. They used special test cars in a variety of situations and driving conditions. The results showed 85% accuracy in spotting irritation. Drowsiness is identified by monitoring eyelid movement and similar success rates were achieved. If the car detects that the driver is tired, is getting sleepy, then the car might start an energetic music or change the light of the dashboard to make it more, more aggressive. On the contrary, if the, it happens that the driver is stressed, then the car should for instance, start a, a calm music. Olivier Pajot, general manager of Stellab, the EPFL PSA Peugeot Citroen collaboration group, says an emotion detector could bridge the gap between manual and fully automated cars. One of the intermediate, intermediate steps is a partially autonomous vehicle. That means that the vehicle will be able to drive by itself, but uh, will still need some uh, uh, supervision by, by the driver. The idea of developing gadgets like these is to improve safety and eliminate driver error, which is now the leading cause of road accidents.